Hey guys, today we're going to do something a little bit different. A while back I painted a lure called the Parrot. And one of you guys, named Pete, suggested I look at one by Bandit Lures called the Parrot Orange. So I looked at that, I thought that was kind of neat. So about a month or so ago, I painted the Parrot Orange. Now, since then, I've used it, I caught a couple of fish. You haven't seen a lot. But about, I don't know, two weeks ago, Bob and I were out, we were going fishing. I said, I'm taking no cameras. I said, for four years, every time I put the boat in the water, I had cameras going. I said, let's just go have some fun. I'm not going to worry about filming. Well, we should have brought the cameras. We probably caught 25 or 30 bass that day. And they were all nice, decent size, good fish. It was really a good day. But the key was, the very first fish I caught was with a pair of orange. I never changed. Use that lure all day, which is rare for me, but hey, as long as they keep hitting it, I'm not changing. And that parrot orange has been a great lure. Well, while we were fishing that day, we were kind of joking about it and this and that. And I says, what I really need to do is take this parrot orange and totally reverse it. Let's turn it completely around and see if it still catches fish. So today, we're going to paint the black parent orange. Stick it with me. Here we go. We are going to reverse the parrot orange. Got to start with our base coat, but because we're reversing everything, we will not be using Createx opaque white for the base coat. Nope. Instead, Createx opaque black. We will put down a black base coat. All right, there we go. It's all black. Now, I'm going to dry this just a little bit before we move on to the next step. So we'll get the heat gun and get to drying. Now, if you followed enough of my videos, you know we can't put colors over black. They're just not going to look right. So the only way you can do that is to put it, take it from black and make it white. So, Createx opaque white. And now we're going to come back and put white, but we're only going to put it where we want to have colors. So one of them is going to be right down the belly. So let's just go right down the belly. Put a stripe right there. I want one right down the back. So I put one right there. And I do want some around the face. I'm going to try to point it a little to the front so it doesn't get back too far on the rest. Gotta get under that nose though. I want a little more on that face. There we go. There we go. Alright, now I got it where I want it. There we go. So now, we still got our black base here. But now we've got the white, and now we can come back and start putting on some colors. Well, let us start with the belly. And the belly was a Createx pearlized lime. So we'll shoot some lime over the belly and cover up our white. And there we go. As we can see, that lime comes through really well because of the white. All right, let me clean that out. Then we'll move on to the head and the back. In the parrot, no, excuse me, in the parrot orange version, the back and the head are orange, but there's a little tinge of yellow around it. So the first thing we're going to do, Createx opaque yellow, and we're just going to do the head. And I don't even care if I get really right down to the nose or not. All right, and let's put a little on that nose, just so the colors stay the same when it's all done. All right, there's our yellow. Got that. Now, let me clean this up real quick. Take a second, get the yellow out of there. And 
And now we'll come back with the Createx Transparent Orange. Throw the orange in. And now what we want to do is come back over the head, but we want to try to leave just the tiniest amount of yellow if we can. And then right down the back. And there we go. Got a little bit of the yellow here. Got our orange up there, our orange back. And basically we should have a reverse parrot. Black and orange and lime instead of white. All right, set of eyes and a top coat and we'll see where we stand with this one. Well guys, I don't know what to tell you. Halfway around this lake, or almost halfway, and I haven't found a bite yet. Man. Not so much as a bite. Oh! <laughs> he was right behind it, but he just didn't commit. And you know what? I think that was a catfish. I saw him. I think that was a small cat. It looked pretty slick. Oh, there's one hit it. Now I got a hit. I haven't seen that one yet, but it ain't a small cat. That's a decent fish. Mm. What do I got? Oh, I got a bass. Yeah, I got to get it with the weeds. I guess he was not quite as big as I thought. He had a lot of weeds with him. <laughs> I gotta get out of the whip the bank here a second, guys. Hey, that's my newly painted lure. <laughs> that is my reverse parrot orange. <laughs> kind of a, I don't, I'm not gonna say it was a joke that I painted it, but mm, it's nice that the very first fish I took with it is that one, parrot orange, black parrot orange. Well, there we go, guys. There is the black parrot orange, and hey, it caught some fish. And matter of fact, I picked up two fish with it that day, that one and a smaller one. And you won't see that video because that was the only two fish I caught that day. Nothing else worked but I caught some with that. So Pete, I want to thank you for Parrot Orange and the idea for the Black Parrot Orange. Thanks for sticking with me, guys. Subscribe to the channel. Hope to see you again real soon.